Hey everybody, Zach here. So I've been asked recently by a, a lot of students, how do I study for a physics exam? So I'm gonna tell you what I do when I work with students. Number one, study past exams. If you're in physics one, all past exams are good. They really do encompass everything and still do. If you wanna look back five, 10, 15 years, that is fine. Physics 2, particularly Physics 2054, the most recent ones are going to be better because the course has changed slightly and they definitely are more reflective of the most recent homework and again, your most recent exams. So about two to three years. You should be studying in blocks of 40 minutes with the goal of doing five questions at a time. So that means open an exam, try and get five questions done in 40 minutes. Take a break. Do another five in 40 minutes, take a break. Get in that mode, get in that beat. Mix it in with homework as well, because a lot of the homework questions you might see as variations on the exam. Not the whole exam, but definitely a good portion. By exam time, your goal should be that you completed all the homework and at least three, if not five exams. Now test time. I recommend what I call a 555 approach. Most of these exams now are 15 questions, give or take. So what do you do? Get five questions done as fast as you can, ideally in about 20 minutes. That can be done. And if not, that means you needed to study more. Then get five questions done that you recognize that should take you the standard 40 minutes that you've been accustomed to. And then with whatever time's left over, there's those five questions that are last, and those tend to be the most challenging, difficult ones. Now, when I say this, I mean, you're gonna skip around. I'm not saying do the first five, the next. I'm like, you're gonna skip around and find five easy questions, five that you recognize and five that are gonna be challenging. That's usually the beat. Again, little wiggle room, but that's usually how it goes. So I hope that helps. Watch this again, take what you want from it, and good luck. Lastly, for those of you that are asking, yes, I am recording content for this class. It'll be coming out in 2024. So until then, I'll be here to provide some guidance, some advice, and some review sessions when um, it's requested.